All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over this real quick. I got my favorite Laster Babe in here to help me get through this. So when we've got tribe, when we've got team, when we've got any unit that's supposed to work together, like if you said, um, you know what, I think a wolf would make a great pet. Well, a wolf's not a pet. Uh, so if you got a female wolf, uh, she would be with you all the time. There would be no leaving her anywhere because she's going to figure out how you hunt, how you do, and then she's going to do everything she can to try to facilitate that. If you got a male wolf as a pet, he would be constantly challenging you for leadership and authority because wolves aren't made to be pets. They're made to be teams, they're made to be tribes, and they know their survival uniquely fits, and they don't change for that because that's that's in their doctrine. So, me, I am inspiration, okay? I'm inspiration. That's what I bring. This, this, is, this is my natural, that's me naturally. That's my natural makeup. That's what I do. All right. So on, on my team then, so this is TJ, this is trainer Joe. Then this is Mary Lucia. Mary Lucia is in formation. Okay. She's in formation. That's Mary Lucia. So I'm inspiration. So that's how I create. I create by ideas, excitement, um, you know, energy, information, Mary Lucia, she creates by, by studying, finding, uh, detailing, uh, overwhelming things with information. Then we've got Lacey Joe. Okay. Lacey Joe is activation. All right. So here we go. So this is, this is our wolf pack. All right. So I get an idea for a class, inspiration. I'm inspired and I'm talking about the class and I'm already seeing the class and I'm already teaching the class and I'm already, and, and, and five minutes in, I've got the class done. The class is finished. And the whole time I'm talking about how wonderful the class is, Mary Lucia is going over what well, we got to have this. We're going to have to have handouts. Where we're going to be, how we're going to, what are we going to do? We're going to, this is what we got to, how much is it going to cost? How much you're going to pay? Then Lacey is waiting to be activated. She's waiting for what do I need to do? So Mary Lucia comes and says, okay, I get inspiration. We need to do this. We need to teach this. Blah, 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 blah. And then immediately she gets information. Now she's getting information based on my inspiration and the information she's getting. She's, she knows that with, this is all the pieces of the puzzle. And here's all these pieces and she just keeps getting more and more pieces and more and more pieces and more and more pieces. And then Lacey's down here and she's waiting for the pieces to be put together. Okay. What, what's the first piece? What, what's our first piece? All right. So each one of us need to understand our position. Each one of us need to understand who we are. Every one of us is necessary. So what happens is, is while I'm in the act of inspiration, which is creation, while I'm in the act of ins inspiration, if Mary forces information on me at that time, then I, then I'm, that's a wet blanket. Uh, okay. We won't do it. Fine. We won't do it. Since I can't provide you the information that you want, since I can't answer these questions, all these questions you have, fine, we're done. Fine. Or if I get inspiration and then Mary gets all this information and then she walks in on Lacey and just dumps the, all the puzzle pieces and then put all this together quick. And Lacey's like, no, 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 you don't understand. That's not how I operate. I operate. I, t I find a piece. Okay. First thing we've got to do is we've got to find all the outside pieces and we've got to separate those and we've got to put those over here. But, 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 but. No, no, no. You don't understand to put a puzzle together. You have to find the outside edges. Okay. That's the way you put a puzzle together. You don't just grab pieces and start trying to make them fit. And Mary's like, we got to have a puzzle together now. Right? And Lacey's like, no, leave me alone. Let me find the outside edge. So let's, let's take this. I get inspiration for a class in my, when I get inspiration for a class within 15 minutes, I've got the entire class taught, the information, the outline, everything's done. Within, if I'm really inspired, 
we're done. Meanwhile, Mary Lucia has to has to come up with all the things that we has to, that have to happen for that class, my imaginary fantasy class, to actually take place. Then someone has to activate that. Someone has to have the 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 ability to come in and say, okay, here's a piece. Where does this piece fit? Okay, this piece goes here. It's a corner piece. We're gonna put the corner piece here and then we're gonna cut the corner piece. And I'm already, I'm gone. I'm not, I'm not sitting there gonna put the piece, I'm not putting the puzzle together. I'm moving on to the, I'm, I'm and, and she's still cutting out puzzle pieces. She's taking a puzzle and then cutting that puzzle piece into six more, cut. you know, she's you know, overwhelming with information, but the activation, so what do we have to do? For this to work, we all have to understand who we are. Every one of us have to understand who we are. I have to understand this is what I'm bringing. Mary has to understand this is what she's bringing. Lacey has to understand this is what she's bringing. Every one of us have to be uniquely in charge of our own area. The last thing I need to do is step down here and try to make this different. And the last thing I need to do is step down here and try to tell this how to do that. This is what you need to do. I got no idea what you need to do here. And I'm certainly not going to get bogged down in this because this is to me, this is overthinking. I, well, I don't, I don't understand why we need to pass over all this because why I, I'm inspiration. I'm, I'm, I'm in the pack. I'm, do you smell that? Do you smell that? And I'm gone. Okay. And information is, wait a minute, smell what? It might not be something we need to hunt. And activation is, how are we gonna kill it? What do we, we need to make sure we're killing this if we're gonna do this. So me understanding this then has have these questions that I have to ask. When inspiration talks, right? Information needs to listen. When information talks, activation needs to listen when activation talks inspiration needs to listen so what do we have to understand if we're going to have a team made up of good hunters then we have to make sure everybody's position is respected and valued all right so let's come down and we have a meeting right and while we're having a meeting, something's said. And when something is said, the first thing we have to come up with is who's talking? Who's talking? So if inspiration's talking, if information's talking, if activation's talking, then we have to have respect for who's talking and what they're saying is important. Sometimes what activation says doesn't make any sense to inspiration. I, okay, so what do I need to do? All right, this is what I heard. You said, no, 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 no. That's not what I said. That's what you heard okay so activation told information she needs to slow down you need to slow down why because information is being it's easy for information to deal with information activation can't be overwhelmed with information because activation's trying to make it work does that make sense all right so Inspiration, the moment you bring information and inspiration, information is like, and the inspiration is going, I, I, you know. Now, if information gets mad at inspiration, <laughs> as often is the case, then I have to understand this is what I heard. It's not what you said, this is what I heard. Okay, so this is what I heard. Next, 
This is what it meant. M E A N T to me. This is what I heard. This is what it meant to me. Inspiration. <laughs> Activation is where we're going to get the fireworks. Information is we need fireworks. Right? So I can say, imagine this. And when I do that, all I see is fireworks going off. Information's going, we need fireworks. You don't understand how many fireworks we're going to have to have. Activation's going, where do you get fireworks? Right? Am I right? Okay. So this is what I heard. This is what she heard. Fireworks. We're going to have to have fireworks. How many fireworks are we going to have to have? This is what she heard. Where do we get fireworks? What I heard, this is what it meant to me. <laughs> Yay! Yay! <laughs> this is what it meant to her. Okay, we're going to have to have this firework, this firework, this firework. We're going to have to have this many people here. This is going to have this many chairs. This is going to be, and this is what she heard. How are we going to pay for this? Each one of us meant one explosion meant three different things. Okay, next one. This is how it made me feel. This is good. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Too much, too much, too much, slow down, too much, too much, <laughs> right? Okay, so then each one, finally, what do I need to do first? So, and, I'm, and the arrows are going the, work, the wrong way. So we're going to put the arrows going the opposite way. See, inspiration's already messing things up. All right, so the arrows need to go this way. For a team to keep working, for a team to keep functioning, each one of us have to understand these four questions. All right? I need to keep getting inspired. What do I... But I need to understand this is what I heard from my inspiration. I need to make sure that I'm, I'm getting good ideas, viable ideas, functional ideas. Why? Because information activation can't be overwhelmed with all this inspiration. I, I just can't come in and just keep dumping ideas over and over again. I have to come. This is what I heard. This is what it meant to me. This is how it made me feel. What do I need to do first? Well, what I need to do first is as inspiration, I need to to say, okay, how, how, how is this going to benefit me? All right, well, it's going to benefit me because I get to be inspired, I get to be creative, but down the road, what's, what's the full term? Is this worth my attention? Is it worth my investment? Do I really want to get information and activation in on this? Is this idea really an idea that information and activation can do something with? Why? Because I've got to be responsible to the team. I have to understand that's a lot of stuff for her to have to deal with. I have to understand, she's gonna, she's gonna grind. She's gonna go over and over and study and stay up at night. Well, I'm, I'm gone. I've, I've swum to the next riverbank. So, just quickly, this understanding of, this is what I heard, this is what it meant to me, this is how it made me feel, what do I need to do first? Many times, inspiration can make information and activation feel like they that they can't do their job. Why? Because inspiration is <laughs> and he doesn't realize that he's making them feel worthless or lazy or not being able to keep up. Same thing for information. Information can feel make inspiration feel like they're stupid and need to slow down and it's too much and you need to calm down and you need to realize all that blah blah blah. Information can go to activation and say this, 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 you know, information can do the same thing. 
activation can come and say, okay, no, I'm, we're not doing this. Nope. Why? Because she understands the cost. She understands how much is involved. So inspiration has to realize what do I need to do first? As inspiration, I need to make sure that I'm filtering things and respecting everybody's position. You can't make a wolf a pet. A wolf's not a pet. You can't turn a wolf in to a pet because a wolf is a wolf. And if you're not gonna act like a wolf, you're not gonna fit into the team. So we have to be willing to create ourselves in a way where we're not making, where I'm not trying to be information or activation. I can't, I'm not capable of that physically. But at the same time, I can't allow my inspiration to overwhelm and drown activation or information. Okay, you got any questions? Does it make sense? Okay, what, what seems to be, okay, so what seems to be, how does this do? Correct. All right. So she said inspiration doesn't even seem to attend the meeting, which is actually correct. Because the time for information and activation to let inspiration know we're all here, we're all discussing this, and just get the second hand discussion because you're not necessarily present. Correct. So this is the deal. And we'll we'll finish up with this. Inspiration is fun. Information is fun. Activation is fun for the person. Me being inspired is fun for me. It's not fun for information. It's not fun for activation. What's fun for information is getting information, breaking it down, figuring out how, how what, what's going on. And what's fun for activation is saying, okay, I'm gonna get the venue. I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get this taken care of. Each one of these things are fun until somebody else comes in and ruins it. And that's, that's having respect for each one of those areas, making sure there's an understanding and an appreciation and a value that each person, this, this makes it work. You can't make one more important than the other one. You have to understand that each one of these has to, uh, and respect I think in the value. Is there anything you'd add to that? I'd add like accepting that the one you're good at is okay to be good at that and not as strong in the other areas because we all are supposed to be in those certain positions. It's not meant for one person to do all three. Right. And that's okay. Correct. Right. In other words, it's okay for you to have fun doing this and it's okay for you not to be this. Yeah. And I think that comes from also a team equating equal value across the board. Um, you know, it's the drummer can't be mad at the lead singer and the, the, the lead guitarist can't say, well, he just sings. He doesn't even know how to play a guitar. Everybody has to understand for the lead drummer, the bass and the lead and the lead guitar and the singer. That's how beautiful music is made. Okay. Cool. All about understanding each other. Understanding each other. Positions and not trying to change each other. Not trying to change each other, understanding each other, and making these things. This is what I heard you say. This is what it meant to me. This is how it made me feel. What do I need to do first? I think if we filtered everything through this, we wouldn't get our feelings hurt. And I think that's the thing that probably ruins teams quicker than anything. Somebody gets their feelings hurt and information and activation talk about inspiration behind his back or inspiration and activation talk about information behind her back or you know instead of information going to activation and say okay what can i do to help you help you what do i need to do first here or activation going to inspiration saying okay this is not this is not going to work and saying okay and you know and everybody understanding and respecting everybody else's position all right that was good for me i hope it was good for you and I hope it helps.